top 15 places to visit in France. People from all over the world are drawn to France's refined culture, which has made it the most popular tourist destination in the world for more than 20 years, getting 82 million foreign visitors annually. You too can level up your life by making a spiffy travel choice up here. France's brilliant structures, exquisite food, premium wine, enchanting castles, and beautiful landscapes make it one of the top world travel destinations. Hey everybody, welcome to your travel buddy, your ultimate travel guide. Today we will go over the top 15 places to visit in France. Please watch until number 1 because it's one of the most amazing places ever seen. Number 15. Rocamadour – A Site of Medieval Pilgrimage this fantastic tourist destination is number 15. Rocamador, which is clinging to a precipice, appears to be reaching for paradise and makes a nice travel inspiration. This wonderful location served as a stop on the Pilgrim's Camino de Santiago route and was the third most significant Christian pilgrimage site in the 11th century. The Basilique Saint Sauveur, the largest church in Rocamador, is a historic site recognized by UNESCO. The Rocamador village holds the feet de Fromage Cheese Festival, which honors local farmhouse cheeses, in late May or early June. Within an hour and a half's drive of Rocamador are more popular sites, like the seven medieval shrines that need strenuous hikes for pedestrians to reach. Number 14. Corsica As evidenced by its spectacular coastline scenery, beautiful woods, and snow-capped mountains, Corsica takes our number 14 slot and is among the best places to visit in France. Lovely beaches, peaceful bays, charming fishing towns, and vibrant seaside cities border the island. At the same time, the interior highlands are covered with historic villages, where time seems to have stopped. The island's unmatched natural attractions entice sun-worshipping beachgoers and active individuals, including avid climbers. Its 1,000 kilometers of shoreline and crystal-clear waters make it a haven for scuba diving and snorkeling. You can think of numerous other things to do in Corsica. Number 13. Chateau of the Loire Valley The Loire Valley's heavily forested environment is dotted with majestic castles, like something out of a fairy tale. The Loire Valley is the largest UNESCO-listed monument in France and makes a nice travel inspiration. It spans 280 kilometers from sully sur loire to chalons sur loire in Anjou. Stately manor homes were also created by French nobility and elites, like the magnificent Chateau of Chevernay and the Chateau Azé le Rideau, in a picturesque setting with a water-filled moat. The mini chateau is an ideal travel destination for families with children, so begin planning a trip up here. Amboise's Park is a wonderful vacation spot. Set on two hectares of woodlands, the amusement park features more than 40 hectares of Loire Chateau built on a 125th size. 12. The Alsace Region Along with the numerous Alsatian towns, the historic cities of Strasbourg and Colmar possess a unique old-world beauty that is unmatched by the rest of France. Strasbourg, a charming and sophisticated city, charms visitors with its winding canals, intricate cathedral, and tiny cobblestone streets. It's a city that beckons you to level up your life. Colmar is a classic example of an Alsatian town with charming old churches and typical homes with flower-adorned balconies. A pristine landscape of foothills covered in vines can be found outside these two cities. The trip via the Alsace villages is a lovely way to see the area. Due to the bright potted flowers that cover the homes and streets, many settlements here are recognized as the most beautiful destination in France. Number 11. Côte d'Azur The Côte d'Azur, also called the French Riviera, is a posh Mediterranean coastline so named because of its intensely azure waters. Due to the region of southern France's generally sunny climate, the skies are frequently a mesmerizing Cerulean hue. Stretching roughly from Saint-Tropez, overlapping with the Provence area, to Menton, 
fewer than 30 kilometers from the border with Italy. Since the early 19th century, the Côte d'Azur has been a popular location for coastal vacations. A nice spiffy town is a place to indulge in the finer things in life, explore art galleries, and stroll down palm-lined boulevards and cobblestone streets. There are several day-trip destinations nearby Nice, including magnificent beachfront houses and renowned art museums. Number 10. Marseille French Marseille takes the 10th slot on our list. It is a sure paradise for spiffy travel inspiration. Marseille, the second largest city in France and one of the oldest cities in Europe, is a key port on the Mediterranean Sea off the country's southeast coast. It has a Mediterranean climate, Roman ruins, and medieval architecture to its credit. The heart of Marseille is its old port, which is dominated by two ancient forts. Marseille is also a working city with several universities and industries. The waterfront of this busy harbor is dotted with restaurants, stores, and taverns. The Calang is a collection of little inlets with breathtakingly blue water in beautiful limestone cliffs, and they are one of Marseille's outstanding natural attractions. Number 9. Léon Léon, the third largest city in France, comes in at number 9. Located near the confluence of the Run and Sewing River, the streets are lined with Renaissance arts and crafts, making the place one of France's best places to visit. Lyon, which has a rich cultural legacy that includes culinary delights and beautiful architecture, expertly blends the new and the ancient. Make sure to sample some delectable cuisines before continuing your journey. The cathedral is one of the most impressive sights, and the old town is lovely to stroll through. There are plenty interesting things to do that you can think of in Léon. Number 8. Strasbourg Alsace's capital, Strasbourg, is ranked number 8 on your favorite travel channel. Due to its magnificent historical core and strategic location on the west side of the Rhine, Strasbourg has long been a point of contention between France and Germany. However, the glassy European Union structures that glitter in the sunlight today and the crowds of students have helped to give this historic city a more contemporary feel. Both the Gothic Cathedral and the charming Le Petit France, home to the historic district of town number 7 in our valley and located about two hours south of Paris, are truly breathtaking. The valley's most appealing feature is the abundance of chateaus strewn throughout the gently rolling hills, ranging from opulent country estates to formidable fortifications and regal palaces. Number 7. Bordeaux this amazing location ranks as the top seven here by your best travel buddy. The exotic travel destination is a paradise, a tourist attraction in France. Bordeaux, a sizable city on the banks of the Ganga River, has a lot to offer. Its impressive old town is fun to explore, and the surrounding architecture is stunning. The Place de la Bourre is home to some of the best wines in the world. Make sure to sample them before you leave. Here, 18th century mansions coexist with opulent palaces and great art museums. At night, the view of the city lights from the Napoleonic era is magical. Number 6. Normandy's Abbey of Mont Saint Michel. According to our ranking, Mont Saint Michel is one of France's top beautiful destinations. Off the coast of France and Normandy, there is a rocky island that rises out of a massive mud flat. The 11th and 13th centuries saw its construction. The Bay of Mont Saint Michel is let that the UNESCO listed abbey is perched on top and is considered a masterpiece of Gothic architecture. Following an alleged visit by the archangel to the Bishop of a Virage, devout monks constructed the magnificent monastery here in 708 AD. The Mont Saint Michel region is renowned for having the most tidal variations in Europe. One of the Normandy region's most notable features is Mont Saint Michel, surrounded by apple orchards, forests, and cow pastures. The experience of taking a trip to Mont Saint Michel is uplifting. Visitors can take in religious services, musical performances, and cultural events at this magnificent ancient monastery. Number 5. Khan. Khan, at position 5, is the next illustrious location we'll discuss in this video. Khan was a sleepy fishing village until the 19th century, but it is now a beautiful destination for a nice trip for yourself or your family. 
The travel destination is a nice resort famous for hosting the annual Cannes Film Festival. Thousands of spectators throng Cannes during the film festival to view the rich and famous up close as they make their way up the steps of the Palais de Festival, where thousands of films are played. The lovely waterfront promenade, surrounded by palm palms, posh hotels, restaurants, and high-end stores like Gucci, Chanel, and Dior, is located before the Palais de Festival. With its close neighbor, Monaco, Cannes has marinas brimming with yachts, five-star hotels, and renowned dining establishments. Number 4. Dordogne as this list of wonderlands in France gets smaller, we hope you have decided on a possible spot by now and are checking your bucket list. But if not, do not worry. There are still a few more spiffing locations, such as this one. You will only select and choose the places you must visit immediately in Dordogne if you have weeks or months to spend in this picturesque region of southwestern France. There is so much to see and do here, starting with the picture postcard perfect Chateau de Bonne and a hilltop castle amid chateau villages. The Dordogne River runs through this stunning paradise scenery. The best prehistoric cave art in France can also be found near Dordogne. Number 3. Riviera The third spot goes to this stunning place of French comfort. Among the best places to visit, the French Riviera has a seaside where you can perpetually bathe in the sunshine. The beautiful destination is situated on a strategic landscape. Riviera is France's fifth largest city and is home to various ethnicities. During the day, tourists can stroll the city's old town or pick a spot on one of Lisa's pebbly beaches to admire the Mediterranean Sea. It is delightful to stroll along the well-known promenade of Des Anglais while admiring the azure waves. Riviera is a wonderful location for a relaxing day out. Given that it blends city life with a lovely location, it has something to offer everyone. Number 2. Provence Countryside The lovely region of Provence enjoys bright Mediterranean weather for most of the year, in contrast to the overcast skies of Paris and northern France. This rural area has a raw, earthy appeal and is unspoiled by the contemporary world, so you should plan it out on your travel bucket list. Here, fragrant wild herbs like thyme, sage, and rosemary grow in profusion and infuse the local food with flavor. A paradise of scents, Provence is. Impressionist painters were inspired to produce colorful works of art by this lucid landscape. The villages' perches that adorn the Provence hilltops fascinate visitors. A and three lined Provence's alleyways and outdoor cafes offer a typical ambiance in the heart of Provence. Number 1. The Paris Louvre Museum Paris is a grand European capital known for its elegance and joie de vivre. It is home to iconic structures like the Eiffel Tower and the Notre Dame Cathedral. The Louvre Museum, one of the best places to visit in France, houses an extraordinary collection of fine arts. The Musée d'Orsay and the Musée de l'Orangerie showcase priceless works of French Impressionistic art, both of which reflect the city's rich legacy. Paris also has beautiful destinations and attractions, like boulevards and evocative medieval neighborhoods. Chateau de Versailles, an UNESCO World Heritage Site, is only a short train journey from Paris. Paris. Designed for Louis XIV, known as the Sun King, this opulent 17th century palace is a testament to the glory and absolute power of the French monarch. Thank you for watching this time. Do subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more incredible travel videos and much more. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.